Don't worry, I'll, I'll meet you in some cave or somewhere like that. I need those citrus berries. Immediately. Ringo, you can't be trusted. Let me go get this hyper potion first. Thank you. Oh, look, a zigzag. I don't even want you no more. Am I stuck? Oh, no, no. Ah. If I'm gonna need Psyduck for a good age to enslave all, all this gen. Why Psyduck? What HMs? I, dang it. Oh, uh, where's the leaf? Ooh, this would be good to give me an idea of how much. That is a lot. Oh, it's good though. Never mind. Yeah, why Psyduck? Does it really? So wait, so Sonic is better than Zigzagoon? That's crazy, because I, I would have never known that. Isn't this another high proportion or just a Pokeball? Hey look, Nanu. Oh, it's super, ooh, it's a super repel. That's even better. Where do I find Psyduck? Psyduck is in the Tim Post game, right? Isn't Psyduck in the Safari Zone? But, like, only in the post game of the Safari Zone? I don't think you. I don't think, ah, uh, don't want that citrus very, ah, uh, I kind of do, I kind of do, I kind of do. Oh, you, you, you can get in the main game? Mmm, that's tempting. That's super tempting, because then I won't need the two Pokemon that I have. Um right now let's get a film such as very wait can Sadek one flash because that would be cool if we could As I said, everything was but that's crazy. That is crazy. How come nobody ever talks about Sadek as an HM slave then? Everybody always talks about Zigzagoon. But if Sadek exists, and I know Zigzagoon you get it because I know Zigzagoon you get early game and the Sadek obviously you don't get in the, until the Safari Zone. But if Sadek is essentially better then Zigzagoon, why does nobody talk about Psyduck? Do I need to do the Weather Institute first? Because that would, if I need to do the Weather Institute before Poetry, that kind of sucks. I 
I never knew that Sada could learn everything but fly. Now I need an evolved form of Golduck that can learn fly. Uh, I don't want to battle y'all. I get. I don't have a choice. I do have a choice. Dang, I do have to beat the weather institute. Dog on it. Okay, that's fine. Let's move you out the way or out of here. And move you also out of here. Oops. And get some sleep. That's crazy. I read. I out of. Oops. I never knew that um, that Sonic was better than Zigzagoon. I just always assumed Zigzagoon was like the one that everybody had to go to. I don't know how less than half. Don't supersonic. Yeah, bite's fine. We don't care. Stop. You know, bikes. Level thirty eight. So one battle done. I gotta go battle these two, even though I only gotta battle them individually. Actually, I'm gonna speed pass this part because these are easy. And I think she's got a Carvana. Yeah, or he's got a Carvana. The only thing that's gonna suck is when I get to Moth Beat and I have to have another Pokemon. And I just need the other Pokemon to be at the beginning of the battle. To like to actually start the battle. But that's it. Swagger, absorb, die. No health loss. Ah, dang it. I knew he was gonna flip too. Absorb, or razor leaf, dead. Zubat, two razor leaves, dead. Okay, maybe three. I honestly thought it would have been two though. And Carvana Absorb die. Or not. Now die. Or not. Now die. Thank you. Alright. Now we face Shelly. I think this is Shelly. Defense lower, we don't care about that at all. We got our health. And that's really all that matters, we got our health.
Fast by the end Oh, we'll wait to leave this thing. How much damage did I just do to myself? And I finally get to see my citrus berry activate? I flinched. I flinched again. Now I got crit. And I confused. And if I hit myself, I die. Dang. That sucks. Wait, how far back do I go? Ah, oh, that's too far. Did I save while I was there? I don't think I did. That's too far. And I gotta go get my low tad back. Up we go, up we go. At least I got to see a berry activate for the first time. Speaking of, let me go ahead and give you another one. I did half my health with one, with uh, with just one swagger. I know it's raining. Can't escape. Still can't escape. Got away safely. Now I'm just going to save right here. So if I die again, I just reset instead of having to go all the way back from Marvel here. For Carvana, I should set up. I 
That crutch is gonna hurt so much. Never mind. Never mind. I thought it was gonna hurt more than it did. Maybe I should have um, clicked absorb instead of razor leaf. I just wanted to kill it. I guess absorb would have did the same thing. There's the swagger. Turn my TM eighty. Turn my swag on. Turn my TM eighty seven on. Um, just don't hurt yourself like you did last battle. Thank you. Goodbye, my Diana. That was it. Where's your Sharpedo, Shelly? No, I don't want your cash for him. Called on GOAT 2 because GOAT 1 ain't available in the game. You Well, actually, GOAT 1 is available in the game. GOAT 1 is Sharpedo. <laughs> Wait, what's up there? I want to go up there. Alright, so we are... Oh, I got to get ready to cast from my bad. Let's go get ready to cast from first, and then we will... I love Scrafty though, I'm not gonna lie. Scrafty is, Scrafty for a while was one of my favorite dark types from Gen 5. Actually it is, I think it is my favorite dark type from Gen 5. It's one of my probably top five dark types period. Cause we got Sharpedo, got um, Mighty Anna, Scrafty is up there somewhere. Who else is in my top five dark types? Hmm. Mavo Stiff. I would think. Oh, well, well Mavo is probably like top ten. I don't know if Mavo Stiff would be like my top five dark types. Now I gotta go look it up. Dark type Pokemon. Honchkrow. Honchkrow is definitely in there. Eveltal is probably is one of my top dark ties. Weavile is up there too. Shift Tree is up there. Oh, she has a slug ma. That's bad. King Gambit is also one of my favorite dark types too. I crook it off. But definitely, definitely Scrafty is up there. I think what they did, um, I don't know. I feel like Scrafty would be Scrafty would beat up in like Gen Five and Six and Seven. You know what? You're right. I don't know why Scrafty didn't get beat up until Gen Eight because yeah, all it does is gang up on people. Wait, I didn't know damage. Why did I not do any damage? It's raining. Embers does nothing. I have to get rid of this slug more like right now. At least it doesn't loom flamethrower. Or overheat. That's a really good question. Why can't why couldn't Scrafty learn beat up so early? I wonder what the design choice on that is, like what what the reasoning for that is. Outside of like the other reasons why I could think of it not learning beat up until Gen 8. But I don't know if we want to talk about those reasons.
Hydreigon is a really cool dark type. It's a really cool dark type. I've never... Oh, don't kill me. Don't kill me. Don't kill me. No! I have to go all the way back to Marvel City. Because I didn't save after I beat... After I beat Shelly, I didn't save. I love Hydreigon. I do... Oh my gosh, I didn't save after I beat Shelly. So I can't like reset. I have to go. Duh. Of all the things I could have got hit, I need to go back and get Surf again. I was so close to Marvel. I mean, so close to Fortree. I'm trying so hard to get through this game and to lose to a critical hit fury cutter is just insult to injury. Hydreigon was a catalyst for fairy types. Probably not the official reason, but it sure felt like it. Um, I feel like, yeah, Hydreigon and Gen 5 was like really, really strong. And I want to say that a lot of things. And I want to say that a lot of nerfs that Pokemon get always end up stemming from like something in the competitive. And while Hydreigon probably wasn't the biggest threat in competitive, like Dark Flying type that was better, that was significantly better than Honchkrow. Um, especially in that Gen 5 like meta, in that Gen 5 time period. Um, yeah, I could see it being like a, like a pseudo catalyst for fairy types. Ooh, you have a Carvana? I didn't know that. We're gonna speed pass it though. Heather from Tennessee just joined the Shark Tank. Thank you, thank you. Or Heath from Tennessee, actually, not Heather. Heath. Heath from Tennessee just joined the Shark Tank. Thank you, thank you. Ah, uh, no. Oh, wait, I already battled him. What am I doing? I can't run in the, in the tall grass. I can't cut the tall grass because it's too tall. You know what's funny? I think it's funny that I think it's up to Gen 4 that you can cut the tall grass. It might be Gen 5. But the grass that's like overgrown like this grass here, you can't cut it. Why can I never escape from the light of this? Let me go. Thank you. Dang. This is what I get for pressing the speed up button. It barely lives. Okay, we're gonna speed up just past this. And then. Ah, oh, bug poison. Annoying. No, Teddy, you gotta die, sorry. Or not. So, this dust tax is gonna be a little bit annoying. I see. It appears to be very bulky defensively. Because I'm doing no damage at all. I can't believe I'm going to have to sit up in front of a dust tux. Or not. Whirlwind me away. I don't think I'm going to be able to beat this. Um. I didn't know about Moonlight. I don't think I'm going to be able to beat this. Oh wait, he can't whirl on me if I ingrain. Strategy. I never thought that that, that would actually... Alright, break is over. Or break is about to end. Catch you around. Hey, I'll be here. All the best in the gen 5. I had Latias, Gar Garchomp, Titar, Hydreigon. So for... Yeah, that's true. Uh, Dark and Dragon was like running over gen 5. Um... Like all these, all the good sand teams and and um, Gliscor too. But yeah, dark types need a, a super nerf. Uh, I'm gonna keep looking across. Thanks for coming out, Scrafty. 
Um, I didn't realize Dust Ox was this bulky. Like, I really didn't. I didn't realize. I don't think I realized Dust Ox was this bulky. At least he can't roll with me anymore, I guess. Sound. That's growth. That's four. That's five. And six. We don't care. We're not attacking you, anyways. And we're back up to full health. Thank you. I did not know how useful Ingram would be until this battle. I had no idea how useful Ingram would be until that battle. That's so awesome. And I was just using it as my like leftovers recovery. I'm just gonna kill it because they never let me leave, so I'm just gonna kill it. Never mind. Never mind, I'm actually gonna kill it. Why is it like this? Really? That's the most busted unknown I've ever seen. Okay. This side, this side. Now I gotta go here, drop off low tag, come back. Battle me. Not to mention Kodio, Kuro, Kokoda, Tarakia, and Yeah. Wait. Okay. okay, speed the button gone. Alright, so now I want to say. Because I'm not going all the way back to Marvel again. I don't care. I do not care. I'm not doing it. Yeah, they were. Terrakion and... Um, I want to say... Thun not Thunderous, but... Land uh, yeah, I think it was Thunderous. Because I don't think people were really using Tornadoes until Prankster. But Thunderous, I think, was getting pretty good use. And... Um, shoot. Tangrowth. Tangrowth back then was a really decent, like, leech seed option. Because I don't think people used Tangrowth offensively back then. Or ever. Um, that's Ingrain first. Because I'm not, I'm not making the same mistake again. Amnesia. I might not beat Slugma ever. Yo, she's boosting on me. She's at plus four special defense. Plus one defense. Plus two defense. She's setting up on me. I should have plus six now. Huh? Yeah. Good lord. Your slug much trash. Okay. So, I kind of missed the Gen 5 meta. Because I was really, really good at it. Like, it was around, like, my peak. Um competitive period well I, I would say gen 6 ubers is where I probably peaked like as my highest like competitively gen 5 OU and gen 6 ubers well I was I've always been good at like every uber tier though I don't think there's ever been a single uber tier that I've been bad at um I played the only ubers that I didn't do is the current one like gen 9 I've, I haven't played gen 9 ubers but like Dang, I killed it in one shot. Good job. Now I don't have to worry about Fury Cutter killing me. And this one is going to be easy because it's a grass type. Or a water type. Lombre is going to die. I thought she had a flying type at this point. Or is that only in front of Lily Close Stadium? Maybe that's only in front of Lily Close. I'm, already, look, I'm level 40. I don't want to be this high, but I just didn't actually have a choice. Because there's so many more trainers, there's so many more Pokemon. 
I didn't have a choice but to get to level 40 this early. Crit didn't matter. Let's see. We've officially been streaming for three hours. Hi, Scott. Bye, Scott. Not battling no trainers. I don't have to. All right, we made it. We made it to Fortree City. I can finally find my hidden power. Actually, I don't have a ball beat. So here's the question, if you're still here, Danny. Um, so I have hidden power now. The question is, question is what do I get rid of to find out what my hidden power type is what move do I get rid of because obviously I need growth and I need and that absorb I'm about to go um, down below my power to go get giga drain so absorbing growth are staying I don't think I need ingrain but it's been a really reliable move but I know I'm gonna need hidden power And then Razor Leaf is Razor Leaf. Um, I can probably find a way to get Petal Dance back. But Razor Leaf helped me get through Gen 2. I can't see why it wouldn't help me get through Gen 3. But I think Razor Leaf is probably the most expendable once I get um, once I get Giga Drain. Of course, I'll have a lot less Giga Drain to work with. And Razor Leaf does have a high crit rate. And I do know that I've been relying on those crits a lot. So... But I need growth, and I'm going to keep Giga Drain because I just have to have it. So, yeah. I guess I can, yeah, I guess I would get rid of Razor Leaf. Um, I'll do it not right now. I want to go get Giga Drain first. So let me get, because I'm, I'm going to skip Fortree. I'm going to skip the whole, well, I can't skip the thing with Steven, but... I'm going to skip all the extra pleasantries and whatnot. You rotate. Go down. Skip that guy. Here's Steven. Does he force me to catch Kecleon or do I just beat it? I think I just beat the Kecleon. Oh shoot, I should have boosted first. This will be, it'll be fine. Okay, so that's done. So he subscribed to me on YouTube too, so thank you for the double subscription. I don't know why my YouTube um, ones don't show up on here, but I'll figure that out later. Ah, okay, skip you. I will just go through the grass to get rid of, to not battle any of y'all. There's a Mariana. I hate that some of these Pokemon kind of force my hand as far as battling them goes, but not let me escape. I'm just doing this barrel because HP. Pokeball. Nugget. Don't need it. Selling this nugget for parts. I did that too early, didn't I? Oh, that's not bad. Hyper Potion. Mm. 
Let me just save in the middle of this tall grass here. This is the lady with the sniper. Turn. 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 Jeez. Oh dang, you're gonna have to battle the twins. Oh wait, I don't have to battle the twins because I don't have two Pokemon with me. Yay! Alright, so let me grab. Low tab. I need to use low tab to cut too so I can cut through that grass so I don't have to battle the twins. Okay, so let's teach low tab cut really quickly. It can't learn cut. Um Okay. Anybody here already have cut? I didn't mean to do that. As Psyduck's that, common in the pond area. Um, I uh, I could just go get Psyduck. Yeah, let's let's see if I can go get Psyduck really quickly. Oh, you gotta go to Ludico first. All right, I'll go get a short branch because I know a short branch can learn cut. Short branch can't learn cut either. I hate this game. I need you to stay. Store. Store. I could have sworn your pinch can learn cut. Can save blind learn cut? Yay! Okay, so Lily Go Contest Hall to get the Savari Zone to get my side up as my HM slave. Um of course, that will take a while, but I'm not stressing that. I can get that. Right now, we're going to get Giga Drain. And this is very. Give me my TM. That TM19 contains Giga Dream. Da, 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 da. Thank you, Tree Doctor. I am so happy to have this. Okay, so now that I have Giga Dream, now I can teach some floor hidden power. This might be like the worst decision I'll make the entire game, but we're going to do it. Oh, I probably could give her an angry now. Oh well, what's done is done. We're saving. And now we're gonna find our hidden power type. Maybe not. Uh not power the best place to try it. We're gonna try it anyways. Well, we all know Ghost. If we get super effective, if we get super effective, it's either Ghost or Dark. It's not very effective, so it's probably Poison. I think Poison is the only type that's not very effective against Ghost. And if I have Hidden Power Poison, this sucks. This entire one just sucks. And I will actually get rid of Hidden Power, and I'll just go back to something else. 
But I'm pretty sure the only type that ghosts actually resist is poison. Because it's immune to normal, it's immune to fighting. Um, dang, that narrowed out a lot of types. Is it res does it resist bug too? Okay. If there's a Vulpix out here, I'll be able to tell. That's another shepherd. That sucks. I, I hate that it's poison or bug. Those are, those are like the two worst types. But I guess I'll find out here. Alright, so if it resists, it's bug. If it doesn't resist, it's poison. Oh gosh, I have hidden power bug. I'm not keeping it. I'm not keeping it. There's absolutely... There's absolutely no benefit, like zero benefit, to having hit a power bug in probably any Pokemon game. What does bug help me with for any part of it? Sludge Bomb TM is... Wait. I just looked this up. I, I literally looked this up like not too long ago. Random question from a new at work. The only thing good for it is Tate and Liza and the Elite Four guy. And it's not even really good for Tate and Liza because the only Pokemon it would be good for would be um, Zatu. And even then, it's just neutral. Bug is good against the Dark Bomb with the Elite Four. That's true. Squish, what's your question? Besides, like, what is hidden power, which I'll tell you that later. Well, I'll tell you that if you ask. Skills wild. Don't eat that. Can't use it. What do you think, Danny? I, th I, I really think that Hidden Power is a lot less useful than me clicking like Sludge Bomb or Toxic. Which, let me go look for Sludge Bomb again because I was just looking at it. The Hidden Power question. Oh, Hidden Power was your question? Okay. Um, so, Hidden Power... So Hidden Power is based off of 17 of the 18 types. Hidden Power came out before Hidden before Fairy types came out, and Fairy did not get added to the Hidden Power list. So there is no Hidden Power Fairy. If I recall correctly, there's no Hidden Power Fairy, but Hidden Power can be any of the other 17 types. Let's see. Um, Sludge Bomb TM is due for a Town Hall. Talk to the guy near the TV. And you need to beat Norman, which I've done all of those. But to go all the way back to do for town, I gotta beat Winona first. But um, yeah, so what Hidden Power does, it's so Hidden Power is almost like Trasalization. Except um you don't wear a hat and it doesn't change your type. Hidden Power is like a, a essentially a hidden type that you have. Um But it pretty much is like it's one hundred percent depending on your IVs. The amount of damage it does is depending on your is dependent on your IVs, and the um, the actual IV spread you have determines what your hidden power is. And it sucks because you can't control your IVs. I mean, in a ROM hack you can, but like in the actual game you can't control your IVs. So whatever hidden power type you had um, back then, you were stuck with for that Pokemon. Unless you bre like unless you breed, you're stuck with that Pokemon. Did I do this wrong? No, I did, I did it right. Okay. So hidden power without the ability to, to manipulate your hidden power just sucks. 
But in competitive, head of power can be good because in competitive you can kind of manipulate your EVs, your IVs. I say. I mean, I mean, yeah, your IVs. You can see this is where basically would come in handy instead of Giga Drain because I only have so many of these. I feel like I was talking, I was saying something, and then I stopped. Oh, shoot. Oh, shoot. Gosh, I forgot about this. I took... Uh, I was looking at the sludge bomb stuff on the one. Um, so I can use Hidden Power on Poochiana. And then I'm only going to use Drowl. I'm not attacking with Lotet at all. This is a Sunflower Solar one, so I'm only going to be attacking with Sunflower. At least, at least we confirmed this bug. Screw you, Lotad. This sucks. I, I, I did not mean... I completely forgot about this double battle. And I don't think it had to be a double battle either. I'll be able to check when I get out of the um, the match. The only double battle that I am forced to enter is um, versus Tate and Liza. And I need to figure out how I'm going to do that. And I think I, what I'm just going to do is pretty much just what I'm doing now is um, have low tag click growl until I die. Or until it dies and then just not use it because I don't need to battle oh whoops because I don't need to battle um, any other gym trainers or what I can do is I could have low tad faint after the first battle which would allow me to walk through all of the rest of the battles without having to battle them. And just get through the puzzle. And then if I do that, um, I can revive Lotad to do Tate and Liza. And then let Tate and Liza kill off Lotad again and have so far do the rest. I think that's the only logical way that I can, that I can make that work. I guess I can't use toxic. I can't do toxic on the poison type either. I think I'm gonna have to get rid of ingrain. Cause I can always use potions. I can always um, go find a crap ton of berries. I think that I'm going, like I think I don't have a choice. I think I actually have to um, get rid of ingrain if I want to make it through. Cause I can keep I can keep hidden power bug, and then keep sludge bomb for like the other grass types. But I might need to get razor leaf back or petal dance. Okay, done with that. That was annoying. Oh gosh, now it's evolving. I'm so failing this one. Okay. Um, I need to other my Yuki Dragon already, and I hate it. Save.
Wait. Um. No, let me go to Lily Cove. I don't want to. Um. I don't want to use my escape rope because, well, I can fly off. Uh, I gained, made it, okay. So I think going to Lily Cove would probably be better than going back to Fortree. I jeez. That crit was not necessary. Okay. All right. We're going through. Ah. <sighs> Thank you. Turn. Stay. And ah, uh, uh, I missed it. And go. All right. So I made it to Lily Cove. Which means nothing because I still have to go all the way back to Fortree. Um, whoops, didn't mean to do that. Are there TMs in here that are useful? I don't know, and I won't find out because I don't feel like battling you right now. Um, let's see. I don't need you anymore. Um, I don't think I need. Oh shoot. Do I want to go get Sludge Bomb now? Not really. I have Toxic. Um, How do I beat Tropius? I would have to beat Tropius with Hidden Power. That's going to suck. I might have to go the long way and get... You know what? No. I'll just, I'll just deal with Tropius the way I've meant to deal with... Well, let me get rid of these two first. So, since I don't have Pain and Power Fire, or anything that's useful against that Skarmory, um, Danny, I need your help to help me get past Skarmory. And Altaria, and um, Tropius. Oh, shoot. Hidden Power Bug would mean that Hidden Power is, my Hidden Power is physical. So, for hidden power, and I don't know if there's a way that this can be looked up. I know the hidden power type is based on your IVs, but is the move hidden power still special? Because if the move hidden power is still special, then I can deal with Tropius. But if the move hidden power, if the damage that's done is based off the type, then I'm screwed. Oh gosh, if, it, if only in Gen 4 is it classified as special attack. That sucks. That sucks. That means that That means that hidden power would be based off type. Hmm. Hidden power bug is the worst hidden power I could have gotten for this run. This is worse than um, the last time I did this and got hit by a poison. Oh. 
Oh, hidden. Wait, hidden power. All of his auto strike because normal is physical. Oh. If hidden power is classified physical, pre gen 4, because hidden power normal is physical, or default hidden power is, is normal, which is physical, then I don't need hidden power at all. Nature power is. Nature power is. Um, I think it is an egg wolf. Let's see. Gen 3 Sunflora. The secret power is a TM. Nature power is. Yeah, nature power is an egg wolf. And if we think I'm about to grind. Another Sunflora, which means I'd have to find another. Or I'd have to probably hack because I'm not finding another Sunstone. I just have to hack one in. Oh, that's bad. It was bad enough to have a bad hidden power type, but to learn that hidden power is classified as physical anyways makes everything ten times worse. There's a Kekle on there. I have a super repel. What am I doing? So, bad hidden power type. Um, hidden power is physical, which is bad. Bad hidden power type, which is worse. Um, Sludge Bomb won't affect Skarmory. What are my other options? What are my other options? Leech Seed is an egg move. Hyper Beam is physical. I could go... Mm. My only answer would be to go back and reteach it pedal dance. Which means I'd have to find the move relearner, which I think is a Lily Cove. Unless that's just the move deleter. So right now, or I could find Solar Beam. Maybe. So right now, I track double team cheese. Um, I'm male. I'm a male so flora. A track isn't impossible. Double team could work. The movie learner is in Fall Armor Town. Hmm. Movie learner is in Fall Armor Town. If I go to Fall Armor Town, I can probably. Hmm. Oh, the heart scale guy. Well, I can't do the heart scale guy without going back to Lily Cove to go get me a heart scale. Because I know there's a heart scale in the rock. Um, in the rock by the beach. And you're going to have to farm with either Good Rod or Super Rock or Love Dish for heart scales. Well, I only need one. And that rock that's, in the, that's on the beach, like on the left hand side, kind of like off to by itself. Um, dang, this is a lot of planning. I'm glad this one. <laughs> Winona Swablu knows Parasa. First off, Winona. Wait, Winona Swablu knows Parasa? Lily Cup is the move to do it. Okay, yeah. So I have to get past Swablu before it uses Parasa. Because if it does use Parasol, then I lose.
because I obviously can't beat all of my known as Pokemon in three turns, including the turn that I'm that I get Parasong. Um. Oof, goodness gracious. Okay. So I guess my first move. What's the fastest way to get back to Fall Harbor Town? Is there only one way? There's only one way. Without just beating my own. Uh. Well, or going back to where I was just at, going down here and going all the way across. In which case, taking Route 119 would just be faster. Hmm. I'm glad all of you are here to help me through this because I, <laughs> I don't know what to do. I mean, I can like level up to like level 50 and just not worry about dying. Um, how many X items do I have? Because I might just have to tough it. I have one X special, which I don't need that because I have growth. And I have no other X items. And I know if I go back to the Lily Cove department store, I can get more. Um, I'm going to keep this zinc. I wasn't going to sell it, but I'm going to keep it because I'm going to need it. Eventually. Um... Keeping that, keeping that. Need that for Giga Drain. Need these two because I need them. I really want to get rid of this Moonstone. Um, keeping all of these. X special. I don't think I'm going to end up needing the Quick Claw. I just can't find a reason. Parish Song does not count as a status condition. So I can't, like, lava cookie it away. I believe, if I'm not mistaken, Parasong is a field effect, technically. I can get rid of this repeat ball, but it's only $500. I'm going to get rid of Facade because I'm never going to use it. And Skill Swap. Safeguard. Um, That's a good question. Google says no. That sucks. Hmm. the TM for safeguard at the route east of four at the route east of four tree oh we to catch any cat family hmm This is frustrating. 
Wait, did you have ex here? No, I didn't think so. Okay. I've sold everything that I could logically, logically uh, think to get rid of. I think... Hmm. Let me look at some flora. The some flora. Right now, I don't have a use for hidden power. I know it's the only hidden power in the game, though, so I don't think I can get rid of it. Um, but anything some flora can do with hidden power bugs, some flora can probably do with sludge bomb and giga drain. Hmm. So I can probably get rid of hidden power. Well, I can get rid of ingrain and get sludge bomb. Get rid of hidden power and probably put toxic in its place. I can always go find a double team TM and um, teach a double team and just be super cheesy and Giga Drain Skarmory until I can't Giga Drain it anymore. We'll figure it out. We will figure it out. Alright, so what needs to be the first thing I do? What needs to be the first thing I do? Um, go to the move rear learner and get pedal dance. I think pedal dance is probably going to be my best bet for beating Skarmory right now. Okay, let me put my pedals back on. It's online Pokemon. Hey Manu, um, this is not, um, this is, this is, um, anything online. I'm just doing an in-game run through of, no, get more hidden power from the secret power shot back in Slakeport. Oh yeah, you're right. You're right. I can buy it now. So I can get rid of hidden power now and just save it for, and just go back and get it later. Um, okay. That'll work. I think that's where I first tried to get hidden power and it didn't have it because it wasn't open yet or something like that. Deep in the damage shock. Yeah, you got to be deep in the damage cock for for gener Oh shoot! Dog on it. I need another water type. I forgot to surf. Ooh, baby. Dang. I was in Lily Cove City and I forgot to go get the Poke Block case so I could go get Psyduck so I could didn't need another HM slave. Now I got to go catch another water type Pokemon for no reason. In the Gen three, they make you fight for the dang old water types. All of this is stressful. At least I know as long as it's not a magic 